Good morning, my lovelies. Good morning. How are you guys doing? How is the weather where you are? In Denmark, it's so strange because it's a little chilly in, in the morning, but it's actually pretty hot in the day. Which is actually pretty nice. It's pretty nice. <laughs> it's pretty nice that the summer is coming back to say his last goodbye before we turn to autumn. Yeah. Okay. So. Uh, when I tapped into the energy, there's actually different things. One thing is clarity. There's clarity coming your way. Something that has been delayed. You will have more information about something that has been delayed. There could even be something about a package or something that has been lost. Um, yeah. Something that you're waiting for when it comes to the postal service. I know that that's the factor for me. <laughs> Is it you, Mumu? Good morning! Good morning, Moon Look who it is! It's so funny, she always needs to have her power here. Good morning. Oh, good morning, sunshine. Good morning, sunshine, one one. Good morning, sunshine, one one. Have you been out hunting mice? But yeah, there is a lot of things going on, I feel. And we want some food, so I'll be back and then I will talk about the rest. I'm back. One thing that has happened for me and that I am also sure that happens for a lot of other people is new people coming into our life and it can be people that you didn't expect to come into your life uh, friendships or someone that you are supposed to help or someone who's helping you I'm sorry if you can hear me <laughs> eating in the background yeah nice to eat <laughs> um, it doesn't necessarily need to be someone from the past but it could be someone who is close by someone who's connected with your neighborhood or your past yeah it could be there was something else what was that oh yeah i also feel that for some of you guys there is someone who is like stalking is a is not the word i want to use but someone who's paying attention to you, someone who is, you know, like, they're looking without interacting. Does that make sense? They want to, but they are just looking at the moment. That's interesting. It could be a new business partner who is just checking you out to see when it's the right time for me to reach out. It could be someone who is actually like, this person is amazing, I want to get to know them in a love sense. <laughs> or... It could be someone who just really wants to be a friend, but who's like holding back a little bit. Uh, we do obviously have Mercury retrograde still, so things can still, you know, <laughs> take time. But then it's good that we have coffee. Right, Muna? So what oracle do we want to use? Because I actually feel like using a deck that we haven't used for a while. Ha ha! What about this? Dragon Path. Dragon Path. Maybe you have seen dragon signs. Hmm. If you have been thinking about giving something away that you are not using anymore to someone who maybe could use it, do it. Because there will, ha there will be hidden rewards in that. Mm -hmm. There you go. So, spirit, today, on this lovely Wednesday, there's something about today. Lord Kutumi. Whoa, have we ever gotten this card before? That's a powerful card right there. The time is also getting closer for me and... I was just about to say Luna. <laughs> I was reading Luna and said Luna. I was about to say, Kiri, it's almost time for me and Kiri 
to go to London. I'm so excited. I haven't, listen, I haven't been traveling for four years because of Corona and because I needed a new passport. So this is big for me. So also with that, try to look, you know, close at something you haven't done for four years since uh, Corona, probably. That is coming back. It could be law. It could be whatever. Uh, I actually heard just being happy. Like I haven't been happy since that time. Well, you are the change. Well, look at that. Lord Kutumi, I might say it wrong. You are the change. You are the change. I am also going to, by the way, change. Going to start on the monthlies. I have some days off, so I want to do it. I want to do it. If you desire to be able to hold the energies of the fifth to the seventh dimensions, ooh, okay, okay, you need to be clear of all your earthly vows and fears and your deep need for control. <laughs> we know. <laughs> I feel like something our, us, our, well, that's a beautiful way to say it. Our human is battling with is control, right? Like, big time. Okay. When Lord Kutumi first arrived, so that is the dragon, I guess. Maybe some of you guys have dragon spirit guides. You guys know I have Avaron, but I actually haven't really communicated with Avaron for a long time. I spoke about this not long ago. Like, this visualization and communicating with my spirit guides, it's actually been a while. But we know when there is no activity when it comes to our spirit guides, it's because that, hey, you got it. Which, we did get that message yesterday. But, Lord Kutumi, when he arrives, he lost no time informing me who he was. I am a dragon elder and spokes dragon for the Galactic Council. <laughs> wow, okay. He went on to say, if desire to be able to hold on, what we just talked about with the fifth and the seventh energy, right? Well, so that is a loud and clear energy for vows and fears and our deep need for control. Your light bodies need to be in alignment with those of the Earth's Earth and the astrological light matrix. So there is something happening beyond your human understanding at this time. You are the change. Um, with that, something that just popped up is that you're also the change of the world. Like, the more of us who awaken, the more the, the world awakens, the more people awaken, right? And you're probably one of those people who are supposed to be a part of that. That means if you are shy or fearful of actually presenting yourself to the world, maybe doing YouTube or doing posts or vlogs or whatever, how, however you can shine your light, then it's fear, then it takes over. So you do need to really think about how can I put myself out there? So is there something that's holding you back from doing that? Again, now that we got the first message with someone who wants to connect with you, maybe it's because that they, they feel like there is something that holds them back. Like you need to be ready for love or whatever it is. I heard someone say, are you looking in the right direction? Seven of Pentacles. So there's still something that needs to happen here. Then we also have a King of Swords. I will say he was a little bit like up and down, which could be because something is not ready to come in. The clarity, because we did speak about that in the beginning. Haha, <laughs> temperance. Yeah. Sagittarius energy. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Some, I have to feel like something still needs to happen also because look at this. It is reversed, which I do like because it means with the five of pentacles that maybe you realize there's something that's just not good or fun. Something that's hindering you. What is happening if I put it up? Upside down. I want to see if there's something that's aligning. One thing that I actually got from this is a, like 
there is a haze like while you are looking at something options or doing something there is with the clouds from the king of swords in the middle there is a haze that's starting to lift so that you, you see the pathway then something you're like finishing up that you started look at this a little bit and then you also have this little crown well normally there is a crown but in this card it doesn't really look like a crown. It looks like something that's not finished, right? Because in the normal tarot, you do see a crown, but it's, in this card, it, it kind of looks like something that's not completely finished, which is actually another sign for this. Obviously, I do have to mention that there could be something with a air sign, male or female. Some Well, it could be someone that you need to let go, Someone you're confused about, or someone who is a little bit confused. Because that maybe you need to finish something? Does that make sense? There is a lot of input coming, so it's <laughs> it's like, what is this? Because obviously there's a lot of people watching with different pathways, so... Maybe you need to finish a chapter, something. Close the chapter so that you can move forward to your chosen path. You are the change. I feel that's what I need to say today. 16, 16 with that. With that. I will see you guys tomorrow, maybe even later today. Let's put some pulsy energy out there. Positive energy for all the magic coming.